Hi Dreamweavers, it's me Keisha here, the Enchanted Dream Catcher, and I am back with another video. I apologise again if I sound out of breath, I feel like I'm getting a bit of a bit of a head cold and yeah, my ears a bit blocked and just okay but not 100%. And yeah, if you're new here, I post twice a week, or I will be in 2022, and Wednesday, on Mondays and Wednesdays, and I just talk about witchcraft, magic, uh, law of attraction, beauty and everyday life thrown in for good measure. So welcome to my channel, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and the notifications bell so you know every time that I post. So without further ado, let's get into this video where I am going to be showing you what I got in the Boxing Day sales. <laughs> Okay then, <laughs> another tradition that I have, <clears throat> if you've been a follower on my channel for a number of years you would have noticed, or no, <laughs> should I say, that I do a, obviously what I got for my birthday, which is just for Christmas and Christmas and then I always like to go uh, sale shopping, Boxing Day sales, I get, um, for some of my presents for my birthday I get money so I save my money. I usually I save the money that I get and then I have a little a little splurge when I go sales shopping. So let's do it. First place I went to was the works and they didn't have any of their bag for life, but they had this bag is so pretty, like a uh like a wintry starry night. So yeah, Christmas vibes all the time. Oh, this is a non. <laughs> this one in here is a non works purchase. I got this from um, Superdrug. It's just by their own brand studio London. It is a, a brow kit. I think it was on sale for like £4 or something. So I just got that and thought that would be... Just try that out. Um, yeah, so back to the works. <laughs> so I got... This book I've been eyeing up for a while. I was going to read it on my Kindle or like get it and read it on my Kindle, but then I saw it in the works and it was two pounds, and so I thought I would just get it. It's The Coven by Lizzie Fry, and it is Imagine. I'll read a bit of the synopsis. Imagine a world in which rich. Uh, <laughs> imagine a world in which rich. Why can't I say it? Imagine a world in which witchcraft is real. In this world, mothers pass on peaceful powers to their daughters, but the men in charge decide that the secret knowledge is dangerous, not only dangerous, but illegal. As witches around the world are imprisoned, one young woman discovers a power she did not know that she had. This terrifying force puts her at the top of the list in a global witch hunt, but she and the women around her won't give in easily, not while all women are under threat. So yeah. I'm going to be reading that very soon. That was only two pounds. I got this one uh, called Morning Meditations by Danielle North. Um, it was so ten pounds. I got it for five pounds, and it was just it's a really, really lovely, beautiful book that has so many different has different sections and different meditations and things like oxygen soaring, so the tree of life the illustrations are beautiful as well. So, for example, the tree of life um it just says sit comfortably in a quiet place with your spine straight but not stiff start by taking three nice big deep breaths and breathing in and breathing out uh with the next out breath gently close your eyes start to feel the weight of your body making contact with the surface beneath you let your hands relax if you notice any sounds bring yourself back into the moment 
and then it says about imagining you're in a rainforest swinging a hammock gently drifting off feeling completely relaxed and at ease all around you you the sounds of life are ever present you allow these sounds to fade away into the distance letting your attention drift towards nothing in particular and then you're awakened by the rhythm of the falling rain and you surrender to the moment letting the rain wash away any pain or suffering you've ever felt either recently or in the past you let every drop of rain cleanse your pain away and then it sort of goes on leads you deeper into the meditation so it says there, are an en there is an energy of early moments of the day that's beautifully silent um silent still and peaceful a time before the dawn has fully broken the space between the end of the night and the beginning of a new day is a perfect place to connect with your connect more deeply with yourself morning meditations encourage clarity and energy for the day ahead travel to crystal mountains fly with birds swim in the deep ocean and find your flow breath work movement essential oils and morning teas also included for an energizing start to your day so yeah that, yeah so i look forward to delving into that i also got it was the only one left on the shelf so 10.99 it was four pounds and it's my wellness tracker by anna barnes a journal to help you help you map out the uh, map out and maximize your well-being damn memory card just damn memory card <laughs> so let's carry on <laughs> and i feel like i'm line frame right let's check oh so annoying again like i always say it happened again my memory card was full because i always say i need to get better at um <laughs> deleting old stuff but i never do well it's just because i never i don't know why i just need to get a bigger memory card and i will do it and yeah that's not the point of this video so let's carry on it's got my wellness tracker that i said it was by anna barnes and it has has it's just got lovely illustrations in inside and it's just a good way to track different things so there's like some top tips for self-care in there there's a five a day tracker which you cannot see really uh one for tracking your water intake there's um sleep tracker like calm activity self-care list there's exercise ones um different types of wellness ones yeah just all different kinds of activities and trackers and oh what was that i love that dream catcher but yeah so that one that was the only one left on the shelf and it just looked really cool so i thought yes i'm gonna get that and then this one i saw just love the aesthetic love the cover and it's called the moon fix by Teresa chang um it was supposed to be 6.99 no 16.99 i got it for six pounds harness lunar power for healing and happiness and it's all just um it features 48 lunar rituals to enrich every area of your life the moon fix teaches you how to align yourself with the universe and manifest your deepest desires for an igniting self-confidence and boosting energy to relieving stress and letting go of hurt this intuitive guide reveals how moon power can help you achieve ambitious goals and address your secret concerns so you learn how so you learn when and how to synchronize with lunar phases for a stronger spiritual connection and you discover the secret to successful moon wishing and tips tips to enhance your lunar work so you can use it this is a transformational guide so it's just pretty inside as well so chaps like living with the moon then all about the different moon phases the moon signs moon power um sort of incorporating candles and herbs and incense as a ritual for bathing in the moon uh, ritual attracting abundance mantras for optimism finding forgiveness anxiety antidote uh igniting self-confidence uh full moon rejuvenation yeah there's all kinds of stuff it just looks really really cool and then the final book i got from the works was called the crystal fix by juliet thornberry of luminosity crystals that one was supposed to be 16.99 as well and i got that for six pounds so this one is just about um so to create a beautiful and empowering home environment with healing crystals so it talks about um every crystal and all the good stuff and talk about buying sourcing your crystals caring for your crystals uh traveling with crystals 
and there's just some beautiful artwork in here as well and then obviously you've got a different crystal so jade for example and it gives you um <coughs> gives you a tip to try something that tells you what jade works well with and tells you what it's for and like its healing properties like the color formation it gives you a little bit of the source and the history like chakra use uh home and space and i think yeah so literally just each just each crystal in a nice little quick broken down way which is really handy especially if you're sort of a beginner with crystals or if you're not like super super in, in depth with them like I am sort of thing not really sometimes certain crystals that I'm drawn to I know a lot about but other ones that I'm not I don't oh, apologize morning this head cold <laughs> but yeah so it I think those books look really cool I look forward to using them so I will if you want me to I'll do book reviews on them when I finish them and let you know what I think so I got a couple of clothing bits uh, or bits in new look uh, first of all i got this by rights apothecary uh the sweet dream weaver dream weaver scented body mist and body oil says amethyst infused helps to calm the mind and manifest dreams is this was supposed to be 9.99 i got it for three pounds fifty and i can see the little chunks of amethyst in there so it just looks just looks really cool so yeah so i got that and i thought oh why not uh that was a receipt from something else <laughs> so this one again the light's not really showing it too good but just a nice long sleeve top with a lace v-neck um it's a dusky pink color and it was reduced from 15.99 to seven pounds just an oversized long top so that will go with a lot of things and then I got this soft cotton button up shirt uh, that was reduced I think that was about 20 it was nine pounds and it's just it looks kind of garish in this light but I promise you it is really nice like a khaki green with the check with pink and white and like a darker sort of greeny black color and I to be fair and I, I wear shirts like that um why Oh my god, I swear I'm not bored. I wear shirts like that in the sort of um, spring summer. Well, to be fair, I wear them all year round and just sort of have them um, usually undone with like a strappy top or sometimes a t shirt underneath. So, yeah, so I thought I would get plenty of use out of that. And then I got this in Newlet by a brand called Tenki because um, they have a few like sort of like label brands that they sell in there. Uh, so this one was reduced from £20 to 7 It's just like a really soft um, sweater, like a long sleeved blue with a floral print and it just has a zipper that goes down there and obviously you can just zip it up to whatever length you want and it was just really, just really nice colours. I really like that and I thought I could wear that anywhere. And then last thing i got in there was from they sell some apricot stuff in new look occasionally and we have an apricot store in the town where i live and i saw this ages ago in there just it's just a pink um like a, a kimono -y, cover up -y type thing with butterflies on it and um, so obviously i wouldn't be wearing it now because it'd be too cold but i would be wearing it soon ish hopefully in a few months um and it was 22 pounds i was like oh it's really lovely but i don't want to pay 22 pounds for it it's too much but then i saw it in new look like months later for like seven pounds so i was really really pleased with that so the last thing i got was a jazzy bottle to drink and um, when i drink water at work it's just stay in plastic bottle with the lid i do have one at work a butterfly one a big glass one but i find it a little bit too big for trying to drink water at work trying a bit too much so this one just has the hand of hasman it just says good vibes only on it so yeah that was cute and then that's all I got from there. And then I actually went into a cart, but I didn't get anything um, in the sale. But I just I think it was a new piece, and I just fell in love with it. And you'll see what I mean. It was a definitely a splurge, a treat myself splurge, as it's just 
just uh it's just like literally so my vibe i just love the colors it just feels so soft i think it's hand wash only um and it's uh it's just it's just so pretty with the um it's got like that sort of eyelash you type material on it it's just really soft and just boho-y like aztec -y sort of and yeah just the cardigan just soft and pretty and yeah i literally was like i saw it and then i was like i really really like it but it's expensive and then i was like i can't walk away from it because i really really love it and i know that i'll just wear it all the time so yeah that was the reasoning i told myself of why to get it so i got it <laughs> but yeah so that was that and then the last little bit we have from the Matalan. so i got some more of their fake uggs these were 10 pounds i got a pair last year like a bigger pair um like as in bigger sort of bit higher up hair and they lasted me really really well like they're not wearing funny or anything because the soles are nice and chunky so these are a bit of the smallest smaller ones and these were 10 pounds it's like a tanny brown no i'll get good use out of those no my god uh they're april super stretch um skinny jean or skinny, super skinny actually these were reduced to nine pounds and they have fray at the bottom and just sort of like a rip a rip there and there and i think they got a little i don't know if they got and then they got the same on the other side and i just i do love a good skinny jean and a good ripped skinny jean of that and myself another bra uh, and these are more these are the jesse ones more super stretch skinnies these are like in a sort of acid wash gray and the last thing i got from there was some more skinnies some more jeans again it's like nice blue just with the ripped knees and just sort of a straight puff at the bottom and yeah that was everything i got so yeah so i was busy busy <laughs> yeah i was pleased what i got so mainly just got a few more clothing items i do have quite a lot of clothes but i just always tend to need need something else and plus also like for work and stuff because i don't have a uniform for work or wear my own clothes i just find it always sort of every so often need to have like a refresh and stuff and these are just sort of basic staples but i'll obviously wear them and wear them and wear them again <laughs> so yeah so i wonder did you any of you guys did you do any sales shopping unboxing day sales like online or in person and please tell me what you got because i'm really nosy and i love stuff like that so until next time keep dreaming and stay enchanted Mwah.